Welcome back, folks, one and all, to us murdering ants. Murdering all of the ants. So anyway, when we last left off, Barry Coleman was murdering an ant colony because it was there and they decided to attack me as soon as I went in. I suppose it might be a parable of being too curious for your own good, but it's not like these people are very strong so far. Admittedly, that's only... We sense you are not one of the creatures that invades you from above. Us from above. Who are you? My name is Barry Goldman, and if you actually listen to me, you might actually, you know, I might not have to kill you all. You deal with that. I'm looting. It's the epitome of letting your ranger pet kill a creature while you go skin something. Look, why don't you just listen to me? Deacon, thank you. Just let me speak. Give it up! You ain't got a chance! Well, we would have been friendly with you, but you murdered absolutely everyone. And there isn't actually a, a hive left. Oh, yeah. About that, I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, wow. Magic bolts. Magic plus one bolts for that crossbow that we don't use. Look, I was not going to attack you. And then Deacon goes all Rambo on you and kicks everyone's ass. Bolts plus two. Well, I'm just gonna let Deacon do whatever he needs to about there. Probably involves a bit. Oh, look! Murdering workers. Deacon is the slayer of civilizations. Okay, there's actually a warrior there. That one's a little tougher. I say a little tougher because they're trying to be too easy. actually get to me. I'll bust your good. You are not what we expected. You ain't got a chance. <laughs> not what we expected. I can't answer your queries because I'm I can't answer your queries because I am a human. can't answer them because I don't have telekinetic mind powers, okay? Look, I'm going to break all the way through your camp, and I bet at the end you'll be like, oh, please don't kill us, and I'll be like, I wasn't trying to kill you, I just wanted to say hi. I'll be like, hey, you know, the slards, they're going to kill everything, unless you help me. Oh look, the aura's vanished. Look, I don't want to actually kill you. But you guys want to kill me. Like, I'm physically trying not to hurt you here. And I'm just not being allowed to do so. It's a darn good thing this isn't affecting my alignment adversely. It's a darn good thing you're classed as monsters, not helpless creatures. Look, I'm just looting your everything, okay? And then we're just going to... You'll then probably help me against the final monsters. That's how this works. But actually, I don't even want to go in that room. Or in fact, this room. Just keep going. Ah, warriors. 
You guys are things I actually don't have any qualms in murdering. Because you are made for war. Being for me and warriors. Workers are made for working. Warriors are made for dying. Oh, you actually drops. Oh, stop coming into combat! Look what happened there! Hmm? I was all fine with just letting you live, and you were like, I must kill myself on Coleman's Blade! And thus you did. I like the fact that you can deal with the slard, but you can't deal with me. Join a stranger, the hive will no longer harm you. Come and speak with us. Oh, finally! Finally, you are no longer going to attack me. It only took me killing half of your hive. How did I know eventually you were going to go, maybe I should just let him talk to me? If I then have to fight my way out because of a misunderstanding about cheese, I'm going to be really upset. Well, at least I didn't kill most of your workers, I only killed some. Have fun repopulating, Miss Queen. Yeah, the Queen's Chamber. This will be when we have to be very careful. There's the queen. Hello. The Formian's juvenile queen looks at you and her voice slides uneasily into your mind. Peaceful stranger, sad day you come to us, but still pleasant outcomes are possible. We offer you truce and assist you against chaos creatures. How did I know she was going to help us against the Slardy? We are more, with greatest mind, the Hive Queen. Then come the Chaos Forces. They tear and crush and destroy us. They kill our greatest mind. Now we are Queen, though we are not ready. Greetings, my name is Barry. We are the Hive. You are alone? Where is your Hive? Strange creature with all your mind in one form. You are alien. Though your form does repulse us, still we would work with you. <laughs> How do you speak in my mind? Very difficult it is to understand what you mean. This is how we speak. This is our way. Without thoughts, your words mean nothing to us. <laughs> I'm here to kill you. What, what do you offer? We do battle against the Chaos Forces who invade the Hive. You are strong. We see that now after you've killed everyone. Um, boss? Who you talks to? Quiet, Deacon. Okay, Deacon be quiet. But if you go crazy, you let Deacon know first, okay? To battle with chaos forces, we see this too, and we and you fight together. Get fight chaos for foe together. Both be stronger. You agree to go out hive and fight chaos foe. We give you to song crystal. With this, we come and fight chaos forces with you. How, how often will you help me? Just one use has the strong crystal. Use when need is greatest. When chaos force be strongest, we will be there. Hint, hint at the boss. How do I use the crystal? Chaos Force strong, send thoughts. I agree, let's work together. Joyous is this day, when two strangers join together to destroy Chaos Foes. Here is Crystal. When our hive you leave, we repair walls. You are not able to return, none return. Long will this day be remembered in our mind. Go make war for peace, hive friend. Go make war for peace. Go make war for peace. Well, that's a Formian for you. Strange and hive-like creatures that they are, but as you can see, not unwilling to listen to reason. Or the bl the sharp end of my sword, as the case turned out to be. Most people seem pretty reasonable to negotiate with you when you're murdering them all. With a sword. Especially in D&D &D games. It's all strange. But now we have a one-use crystal that we can use to fight the, the slards. Probably in the final encounter. 
where we fight Miss Strange Woman. <laughs> Everywhere is already repopulated. Okay, most of everywhere has repopulated. This place didn't. <laughs> Sorry, I've murdered all of you. <laughs> Long will the day be remembered in our mind when we don't automatically lash out at anything and everything that comes into our lair. Especially when we saw it was killing the Chaos Beasts. Yeah. You may want to think about that, Hive Queen. Caution. You had several lines of defense there. Be cautious. I know people are going to tell me the Hive Queen had something fantastic on her that I would have wanted, but... I'm not a nasty man inherently. I'm not going to kill them just because. Now, if I go back into that cave, into that um, stronghold up there, and a little circle appears around me again, you'll know full well it's the it's the excavated ruins that are causing it. It is the excavated ruins. In fact, the excavated ruins have caused saving throws increased, armor class increased, and immunity to mind spells. Oh, cutscene time! Ray slot. I can see where up my camera is. Well, she's gone. Oh, crud. Oh, crud! Yeah. How does one use it? I wish to use it now. Oh yes! Oh, it's only you. Only... Okay, it summons one of those. Okay, this thing just keeps summoning great red slots. Actually going to attack anything. Oh, she clearly went through the, the portal. Okay, here we go. time I use the crystal for me. I need some buffing going. I need to do this next time actually. Sheesh. Grey slards. Grey slards are exceptionally dangerous. They are literally the second most dangerous form of slarding. The most dangerous form of slard is when a death slard decides to go away for a good number of years and come, uh, a great slard comes back as a death slard. Death slards, unlike the other slards that are just chaotic neutral, are evil. They are chaotic evil, sometimes neutral evil, and they are far more deadly spellcasters. I mean, the repertoire of spells they can use is phenomenal, and they are actually smaller than grey slards, but more deadly. Good thing we're not fighting one of them. Bad news is we're fighting a Grey Slard. So when we come back, folks, Grey Slardy. Till then, folks, until then, I'll catch you later. I'll see you then.